And we're back with some more missing doors with the crims, man. This is the next part of this session of uh, Shield Play Donkey Kong 64. And we are heading inside this boat. And we got another fish with the lights, flashlights, to be helping us. He's so nice, we didn't even ask him. He is just like wandering around here, we mean swimming around, seeing a big huge fucking monkey, and he's like, man, maybe I should help him. He looks like to be very helpless. And that sounds like a fart that, took, that I took yesterday. Oh no. You know what this means, good folks? Oh shit! Look at that! <laughs> Nightmares. I don't remember that guy. It's time for a bonus stage! Welcome to bonus stage! Oh god. Shoot the golden banana. Just don't hit any cones. We did this the last time, and we have already done this. It's quite easy. But I'm cheating because I'm playing on the ball version. <laughs> it's slower. But I think this game is optimized for... Uh, maybe. Some games were that. Were like that. And I can do this with my eyes closed. Look at this. I'm closing my eyes. I never said I had to have them closed permanently. Okay, stop it, Crims. You're not funny one bit! Man, this controller is so nice. Compared to my old controller, which I have used since um, the very young days. And this controller is so good. Ah, drinking water in the water. Don't! You must drink a lot of water! Because if you don't, you will die. Man, that's so boring commentary. It's like, hello guys, I'm Crimson, I'm gonna make some funny commentary. Now does everyone know what 5 plus 6 is? There's going to be that one guy out there, out of five people who watches this in the course of 10 years, who's thinking, what the fuck am I doing with my life? <laughs> uh, was this everything we needed to do in here? Can we use the gun? No, we can't. But we can actually use the C buttons to change the camera. That's uh, weird. And the sound seems to be a little distorted sometimes. I don't know why. Okay, is there any way to get in? Oh, that's uh, for the other cons. Okay, I guess we're done here though. Let's get the fuck out of here! Wait a second. This is not the way out. Hello, starfish. Man, he's big. He's so huge. Just like my Digimon collection. <laughs> oh, here it is. Here be the exit, boy. No, it's just a green bed. What is the significance? Please stop it. I need to get out of it. Oh, there is a big, huge fucking arrow on the ground. I didn't know about that because I looked at it from an angle. Whoopty fuck. <sighs> so, everybody, guess what I did? Well, recently, or not recently, okay, this recently, because I did it like one day ago. <laughs> uh, let's see, we're gonna do this with. We need to lower the water, so let's continue on with the donkey fuck. Okay, um, you know Super Smash Brothers Wii U? That game has 437 songs in it, in the soundtrack collection. So what I did is that I recorded all of them uncompressed with, H with HDMI. And can you guess how long the soundtrack is? It's 15 hours long. Holy shit! So I recorded all that in the course of two days, in two parts, over over the night, and um, now I have it. Now I'm uh, just editing it, making a huge video, a 15 hour long full soundtrack video. I know some someone has already done that, but I want to do it myself because I want for once do a soundtrack. I've always wanted to do that. Make sure everything is perfect. 
and they all know how picky I am when it comes to quality. So, uh, if you want the soundtrack in very, very good quality, in various uh, downloadable forms, then please check out uh, that video. It's going to be linked on my Alexander Engstrom channel. This is the wrong place! Holy fuck! I'm getting so disoriented with this place. I'm gonna kill this guy. So that's what I did. And not only that, during the same period, like, yeah, two days ago, I made um, a new Silent Hill 2 long play in very, very good quality, and I show a lot of stuff in the game and shit. Oh, that's so sexy! And the video is about uh, five hours long and in very high quality, so it is 23 gigabytes of size. But it's the whole game, I show almost everything there is to see. Um, because my other long play on that game is getting quite popular. For me, at least, it's like, uh, let's see, uh, the water level is still up. What the fuck do I need to do? How do I lower it? Yeah, so, um, the long play I have right now on YouTube has like 18,000 uh, views. And a lot of them have watched through it all, according to the, uh, what is it called? Analyze, analytic, whatever it's called. So I want to redo it because that auto, that long play is not very good. So I made a new one, which is a lot better. So please check that out because Silent Hill 2 is my favorite game of all time. Yes, I just said it. And I'm, I'm trying to sound like a very important, cool guy, but that's saying a lot because I've played video games my whole life. And you're not supposed to be here, Crimson. Well, fine. Where is the fucking mermaid? Maybe in there. Or maybe... No, we can't be here. Um, in tiny form, right? No, I don't think so, Grimps. Get out of here. So what do I need to do? I need to lower the water level, but how the fuck do I do it? Maybe I can stomp on one of these. No, that's a tiny switch. That's a switch. Let's see what that one leads. <laughs> Nowhere. Because you failed, Crims. You can't do this. Oh, looky that. I know exactly where that is. Well, no shit, Crims. You were there for like 20 seconds ago. Speaking of 20 seconds, we need to hurry the fuck up. What can be inside this hole? This tiny, tiny hole? Mm -hmm. Maybe some more bonus stages with fishes! No. I am another fish. How am I supposed to take this? Oh, looky that. It's uh, on guard. And there is a golden banana on the other side. That means no more bonus stage shits! How wonderful. Look, I can see the light. That makes no sense. How the fuck can it be white when it's blue in the water? Oh, you can't pick those up. That's on guard. Okay. Then I will just open these up. Man, I really wish that this game and Majora's Mask could get an HD remaster. Because these games need it. You see, this game is laggy and it would look beautiful in HD. Just like Banjo Kazooie. It's wonderful. But now Microsoft is owning uh, Rareware, so they can make the HD remaster, but not uh, Nintendo. I don't know why they don't do it. They can just release it on the Wii U. It would look fantastic. What the fuck is that in there? Oh, it's just a starfish. Okay, cancel this shit effects. Oh, there's some bonus eggs. Oh my god, that banana is so huge. And Majora's Mask, as well, on the N64, is laggy. What the fuck? I just swung right through it! Thanks! And there was a re-release of Majora's Mask on the GameCube in the Zelda collection, which I have. But that game is unstable. The sound, it's... Uh, the sound is not very good. Sometimes it just clips or, you know, it's... It 
that's bad. And sometimes the game just freezes, so there is no stable, good, lag-free version of this game or Majora's Mask. We want that. It's like with the Shadow of the Colossus. That game had it. I think there's like a glitch you can do with swimming through these. But I have no idea how you do it. It's like you tap A and the look button all the time and... And you swim right through it. Ah. There's no glitch shit. We don't have time for glitchy, glitchy shit. So let's just do this the real way. All right, that's good enough. Let's let's head out of here. Man, it looks like Clank was dead there. He has all his muscles. He just gave up. Like ah, fuck. And um, Jet Force Gemini. I know Rareware made uh, Jet Force Gemini, or they published it, I don't know. But uh, couldn't they make an Jet, a Jet Force Gemini Remaster HD? That would be so fucking cool! Oh my god! I like that game, though I've never beaten it. I have it on N64, so we might do a commentary on it sometime. Maybe, I don't know. Yes, I'm not very good at it. Was that all of the coins? Yes, let's just take on Gar for the heck of it. Maybe we could head to the boss pretty soon. I'm gonna try to lower the water level one more time. And if it doesn't work, then we're gonna say FUCK IT! And do what I want, because uh, I am THE pirate. Yeah, fuck you, I can still go. <clears throat> Alright, so recently, in another random news, I've uh, spent a lot of time Perfecting my quality as always. I do that so much. I have, I have no idea how many hours I have put down into perfecting my quality on my videos. When it comes to you know deinterlacing and editing, resolution quality, kilobytes per second, kilobits per second, frame rate, um, sample rate, bit rate, everything. You know, there's a lot of lot of stuff when it comes to quality. And I've been trying to master it as much as I can. Oh, that's the wrong button. So stupid, Crims. Well, there's an on-guard thingy. Wait, the water is already down all the way. What the fuck? How did I do that? The button was pushed inwards. What in the shit? Oh, well, we can still get out of here, right? You have to, Babel. Mm, let's see, um, yeah, so I've spent a lot of time uh, with perfecting my quality, uh, mostly deinterlacing. I spent a lot of time trying out different uh, methods of uh, deinterlacing the video, because these old games are not uh, progressive, they're not, you know, 1080p progressive, they are I interlaced. And if you don't know what that is, I'm not gonna explain that to you, because uh, that's... Um, just go to YouTube and search on Interlaced versus Progressive, and there is a very good video that talks about it. And it's very interesting if you're interested in, you know, video and how it has uh, progressed, <laughs> progressed uh, through history. I think it's interesting, very. And it helps me a bunch when it comes to you know, having very good quality. And there is a boss store right down there! I had no idea. So I found a very good way to deinterlace. And this video is going to be a proof of that. Although, no one will notice a difference. But if you are one of those people out there who knows about these uh, terms, then I can say that um, before in this shield play, I discarded all the odd fields. So that's half the fields just gone to get away with the uh, you know, interlaced artifacts. Um, but this time I have both of the fields, and I have algorithm, uh, Ydif I think it's called, Y-D-I-F something. No, it's not that one. So I have both of the fields and no artifacts. It looks gorgeous, I like it. So I'm very happy I found uh, the way to do that properly. Some of you might notice that the image quality will be better, because we have double the resolution in height. The Y pixels, or whatever you want to call it. 
double the resolution. Never mind, let's continue playing. Now look here, is a big old fucking carpet. Look at that guy. Man, he's so creepy. Oh, I thought he was a long way, I mean, you know, like five meters away from me, but no. There's K. Rule, I saw him! Man, this doesn't make any sense. If this ship is underwater for such a long time, or whatever it is, then this thing would be very rotten and not so good looking. Now there is a book here, I want to read this. Oh, Captain K. Rule's logbook! Wow, I've never seen this before! That's so cool! So this was his ship. Let's see, can we look? Yeah, there he is. That's uh, K. Rule from Donkey Kong Country 2, the last boss. Spoiler! There is even some gold and a bonus stage. Too bad we can't enter it. You know, drinking water when making commentary is much nicer than red wine in one way, and that is that you don't have to pee all the fucking time. Because uh, it's not red wine, but whatever you want to call it soft drink it goes through your system very rapidly and you have to pee all the time oh shit it got dark I got scared can we go under the bed nope we'll have to find his dildos another time speaking of peeing <laughs> you need to do that very soon uh, you know what I'm actually going to stop uh, this part here, it's gone way over 15 minutes, so thank you all very much for watching once again, and I will see you in the next one where we will um, hopefully go to the boss. See ya!